Um, I, I'll just go through two of these other things and we'll go and toss over to what Sarah's been playing. Um, I'm not super far in Valhalla. I think I've probably only cumulatively played like two, three hours, something like that. Um, but just some quick notes for it would be is that it's very smooth to play on PS5. It's Ooh. at 4K60. I do think it has an interesting take on the stamina system and that um, if you look at something like Bloodborne where you can you can regenerate health by striking back at an enemy that damaged you, if you strike back within a certain uh, time frame, you get health back. It's similar to that in that you only lose stamina for uh, pulling off dodges and launching strikes that don't connect with your enemy. If your attacks are hitting, you regenerate stamina. So if you're in a fight where you're just constantly dodging, but you're not attacking, you're going to lose the ability to um, to dodge. So it's kind of like pushing you towards this very aggressive uh, gameplay behavior, which is very suiting, you know, given that you're playing as Vikings, you know, fucking people chopping everyone down with axes. It's not the most mm-hmm. strategic, but um, I, I do like that aggressive push. It kind of separates it even from Origins and Odyssey. Um uh, but yeah, it seems like an Assassin's Creed ass Assassin's Creed game from the two to three hours. I'll have more yeah. thoughts as I go along. But uh, yeah, Cyberpunk's kind of like the main game I'm playing right now. 